the show will go on tonight in Meriden. A few weeks ago, it looked like the city's big fireworks display was going to be canceled because of funding issues. But some last-minute donations have saved the day. News 8's Jackie Slater, she's live in Meriden tonight, where festivities are already underway. Jackie. Scott, that's right. We've got a band playing. There's balloon animals. There's lots of food. Fireworks should go off around 9:15, and there's lots of excitement in the air. But believe it or not, for a while, many people wondered if this was even going to happen. Now, the new budget year in Meriden started on July 1st, and funding for this event was not included in that budget. Last month, some members of the city council proposed taking $20,000 from the city's contingency fund to make this happen, but not everyone was in favor of that. Ultimately, they settled on $10,000, and the rest of the money needed to fund the 4th of July celebration was raised through donations. I just think this is a great thing to showcase, you know, private-public partnership with the city stepping in and helping out businesses and, and private uh, citizens realizing that, you know what, budget's tough right now. Uh, so everyone pitched in. This was really a team effort, so I thank all that were involved. And tonight's festivities kicked off with the singing of the national anthem right around 5 o'clock. Again, the fireworks, fireworks will go off around 9.15, and those go off above the castle. So you can see them here at Hubbard Park, but you can also see them all around the city as well as other towns as well. And reporting live in Meriden tonight, Jackie Slater, News 8.